Whereas man forgets that what Adam alayhi salam did right at the beginning was very big. It was massive, even more massive than what you can imagine because the only thing ever that was prohibited for Adam and Eve or Hawa, may peace be on them, was to eat from the tree. And what did they do? Exactly that. You follow? And they just said a few words that were taught to them by Allah, seeking forgiveness. And Allah says, we forgave them. So, oh man, remember one thing, do not for a moment think that the Almighty will not forgive your sin. That's from shaitan. That type of thought is from shaitan. If you sought forgiveness, you will be forgiven. So the major sins require specific forgiveness. And you must learn to move on. Because sometimes shaitan comes to bog you down. Like I said earlier, he doesn't want you to believe you're forgiven. So what happens? You can't move on. You don't enjoy worship. You don't enjoy reading the Quran. You don't enjoy prayer. You don't enjoy doing the right thing because you feel you're dirty or you're not clean enough. Or you've done things that were so bad that you know what? Am I not even fit to be praying here? Again, that's from the devil. So don't think that. No matter what, you've got to move on. Major sins require you to seek specific forgiveness. Oh Allah, I did this, this, this. I regret it. I feel the remorse. I seek forgiveness from you. And I won't do it again. And Allah says, if those conditions are met, wiped out. How good is that for Islam, a religion of forgiveness? Amazing, amazing.